Hi, I'm Odd. This is Coach Snow from Sharper Aquatic Image. I had a chance to look at your videos from last week's Etobicoke Swim Club Summer Camp, so I want to give you some feedback and some ideas on how you can make yourself a little better swimmer and a little longer in the water. One of the things we want to work on on our butterfly is our synchronization of our kick. There's two kicks to butterfly. There's always one kick in the top of the stroke, and then there's one kick at the back of the stroke. One thing to remember is the feet should never stop. Those feet have got to keep going, stopping at the top of the stroke or the bottom is a no-no. We want to keep the feet moving. When you kick down, let's see if we can get our hips up a little bit. That's the whole idea in butterfly, is to flow smoothly through the water and let's maybe not climb so much when we go to take that breath. Our body's really coming up high on our butterfly when we take our breath. Here's our backstroke, a different angle because we didn't have a great angle on the underwater shot here, right? So I like the things you're doing here on your backstroke. You're, you're rolling the shoulders, but you're also bouncing a little bit. I don't mind that so much as long as you have a chance to roll those shoulders in the stroke and have a nice clean entry. Let's not slap the water. Let's drive our baby finger down and catch the water. I'd like to see if you can work on your kick a little bit. The kick's a little bit weak. We gotta get our hips up. Our body position and backstroke is super important to be flat in the water. And let's see if we can get the up, upper body back a little bit and lean that hips up towards the surface more. Let's see if we can get our bathing suit breaking the surface a little bit, right? Head position's good and your shoulder rotation is also very good. I like that part of your stroke. At the back of your stroke, let's snap that hand and let's get it out of there. A little faster hands on the back of the stroke. Okay, here's your breaststroke. Let's do a bit of a separation between that dolphin kick and your breaststroke pull. They can be separate with a little, a little bit of space in between each. Now on your breaststroke pull, let's see if we can be a little wider and then get on top of those elbows and then drive those elbows underneath your shoulders, right? We're kind of getting stuck a little bit when the hands are close to the chest. Let's see if we can rotate around, get the elbows under your shoulders, and let's see if we can get some really good stretch on the kick, right? Snap the feet, point your toes out, and let's keep our feet together at the back of the kick. Keep our feet together, and let's be streamlined on that stretch on your breaststroke, right? I like your head position, you're dropping your head a little bit, but not too far. Our goal is to get lots of distance on the kick on breaststroke. Right? Half our power comes from our arms and the other half comes from our legs. Let's get some distance on our breaststroke. Oh, now we're stopping a little bit. No, here we go. Keep the drive forward, get some distance on the kick, and then hips up a little bit, right? Here's our freestyle. You've got a really nice freestyle. I like your dive here. Not many people dove in this session. Um, let's see if we can work on getting a little bit longer on that breakout off the dive. And let's see if we can get the hands down a little bit by catching the water. You've got to be clean on the top. And we're leading a little bit with our left elbow. Get on top of the elbow, turn the corner, and get underneath our hip on that, right? Snap the hands all the way to the back of the kick. And speaking of kick, let's not forget to go up and down six kicks every two strokes. That means your feet never stop. You gotta keep those feet moving, right? Let's not let the kick stop and let's not cross over. Good distance on the kick and really stretch it out. Alrighty, good work. I like your swimming. I think once you start to work on your technique more, you're gonna find yourself going faster. Have a great holiday and we'll talk to you later. All the very best. This is Coach Snow.